Welcome back to Amnesia. As you can hear from my voice, I'm not too, be too thrilled to be playing. Ooh. Me likey oil. I saw you. I thought there was a button to crouch in this game. Ah, why did I even try? Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, uh, I've seen what you guys do. I'm not gonna give it away for anyone who's watching this blind, but... Yeah, I've seen the other LP. <laughs> So, am I supposed to be going down into the refinery? I think that leads down to the storage. I guess I'll go down. Why is it always down? Oh. Sort of organic tissue blocks the path to the refinery. Can it be dissolved? Yes, indeed. So the fact that I have watched um, LP of this kind of sucks because the puzzles aren't quite going to be puzzling. No. Oh! What? Did I just smash a window and leave? Seriously. Archives? Didn't I come from archives? Cellar and laboratory, of course. Laboratory. Where do I want to go first? Can I not like these? Oh. fell to the kitchen floor. Tears were beginning to well in his eyes as he received the first kick in his stomach. He will remember being hidden and fear she too will be punished. Ah. Look at the sweet holy light, Daniel. What, what, what is it? What is it? You're one strong man.
other than I don't want to play this anymore. <laughs> Lack of a chimney to properly vent the fumes from my most recent experiments has taken its toll on many of my less stable ingredients. <coughs> Sorry. Some seem unaffected, but many are stained by the fumes and will be difficult to salvage. I shall do what I can and move them to the wine cellar. third attempt to produce artificial vitae. The former compounds lack the potency I need, but I sense I'm close. Calamine and augment are a given, and the cuprite binds them well. This time I'll attempt aqua regia instead of aqua fortis, and hope it will produce a more even solution. The experiment was unsuccessful. The solution is highly acid and proves impractical to put up put to any use except as a detergent. Organic tissue reacts especially violently to the solution and should be handled with the greatest care. I might be able to use the recipe, but I'm losing hope that I will find an al alchemic solution to my predicament. Ah, oh god, I got a cough so bad. Oh, there we go. I feel better now. Hello. Why don't you have- oh. I was about to say, why don't you have a fire in you, but... for the thought of you, my love, I wouldn't be able to go on. When I find myself doing terrible things, I take comfort in you. As long as I am able to think of you and long for a life together, I know I'm better than the others. I weep for them. They lust for power without restraint. Where I only crave for fair judgment and a safe return. What? Does it do it again? see. What are you? Yeah, 
other children cheered him on, his name voiced in the steadily rising pace urging him to do it. Am I really doing this? The young boy thought, and struck his victim with a rock. Ouch. Okay, well... I guess I'm supposed to go back up the archives over there. It's the only w way left for me. so disgusting. You know where I first heard of Turkish Delights? In Narnia. You know how in the movie Narnia the boy, what's his name, Edmund? He's so eager to have Turkish Delights. And yet, I don't know why. They are so disgusting. Why would you want to eat something that's rose flavored? Later that evening, oh, we shit. uncovered a passage beneath the dunes leading to a sand-covered stone structure. The professor was confident it was the tomb we sought and ordered the others to clear the way late into the dark, cold night. Tomorrow, I shall lead the men into the ancient structure, hoping to reach the burial chamber. No matter what the professor is keeping from me, the dig should yield something interesting to take back to London and the British Museum. Yeah, I realize I accidentally, uh, no, what's the, notes, no, those are dice, yeah, I missed this first part here because I accidentally clicked twice, the unflinch, unflinching, okay, the unflinching African sun has continued to plague our expedition making it impossible to dig until dusk. How Professor Herbert managed to find a location in these vast plains of nothingness remains a mystery to me. When I asked him about the tomb again, he told me about the legend of Tin Hinan, the mother of us all. An interesting story in its own not right, but I can't help feeling there's more. And you've seen the rest. Okay. I apologize for that. It almost looks like a chunk of ice up there. God, what's up with the cockroaches? It's disgusting. Gonna step all over these rare books. Timer. Alright, well, cut off the video and see you guys in a little while.